Alright, welcome to Geometry and we will be talking about mid-segments of triangles. Okay, so mid-segments of triangles are just segments that cut opposite sides in half. Okay, so let's say that we had A, B, and C as the sides of our triangles. Okay. Alright, and let's say we actually had a segment that went through and cut it in half. Okay, so cut it in half means these two sides will be equal and these two sides will be equal. All right. So this would be D and E. Okay, so it cuts it in half. Now that's the cool thing about it is that also this measurement it, you can actually find by finishing this up. Okay, so let me show you. All right, so Let's finish it up. All right, now, if I finish it up and had all the sides, let's say I had D, E, and F right there. Okay, here's the cool thing is that this measurement right here is going to be the same as these two down here, B, F, and F, C. This measurement is going to be the same as A, E, and E, C. And this measurement right here is going to be the same as AD and DB. So it's really kind of cool how the mid-segment theorem actually works out. Now another property of this is that this is going to be parallel with this side. Okay? This side, I'm going to use many arrows to define it. This is going to be parallel with this side. Yeah, it's a little off. Okay, and then finally, I'm going to put a line through it just to designate that it's a different side. Okay, this side is going to be parallel to this side. So that, that's the other thing cool about knowing mid-segments of, of uh, triangles, okay? All right, so just remember that if I knew that this side was 5, okay, this side was 7, and this side was... Let's say that this side was 20. Okay, I could know automatically that this is 10 and this is 10. Okay, if this is 7, this is also 7, and plus this part in here is 7, and this part also is the same as the other one, so that's 10. All right, and if this is 5, that this is 5, and this is also 5. Okay. And also at the same time I can use a segment addition postulate to add these two together and I would get 14 and 10. Okay, and I could actually tell you that this is correctly a triangle. Okay, all right, that's it for mid-segments of triangles. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Bye.